Welcome back YouTube. I'm back with another one. I'm currently in my other garage uh, where I have the frame. Um, today I'll be doing the bracing on the frame for the rear. And I'm also going to show you guys. I'm going to go over what all do I have on frame already and we'll go from there. Alright YouTube. So this is the frame. So I have the trick chassis, upper and lower control arms, TRZ, um, coilover mounts on both sides. Don't mind this, this is a, a engine lift I'm gonna restore. So this is the frame. The frame is already boxed on both sides. Don't mind this here. I'm gonna be uh, getting rid of this. Uh, I'll probably cut this up and use it for something else. So this is the frame. I got the trick chassis lower control arms on both sides. This also trick chassis brace. I have the other brace coming more than likely next week that I'll be putting on. Um, excuse me again, you know, I'm a little bit under the weather. Uh, I braced up the frame here and I also have this here. This is for the coilovers in the rear. The trick chassis anti-roll bar. This is the 8.8. I have the GM big bearing housing ends on the end. The trick chassis 8.8 .8 instant center uppers. And then back here, I have to measure this bar right here. I'm gonna place it in between here and there where you see the holes at, I'm gonna place it there. Um, I have to fix up. The frame notch, I'll clean it up a little bit better. I have the other side notched also. All right, YouTube. So my measurement is from here to here. Um, what I measure from the hole there to that hole is that it'll be 50 inches in between. So this is 50 inches. I'm gonna go over a little bit more and then I can grind down the edge of it to the length that I need. So I'm gonna go ahead and get this cut out and I'll bring you back. YouTube so we got the bar in going straight across here lined up with the holes inside the frame it's also level so I'm gonna take it back off clean up the frame so I could weld on it and cut you guys back on
YouTube. So as you see, we got that one on this side cleaned up. So just, and it's also still level. Get rid of zoom. Still level. So what we're gonna do is gonna go ahead and weld these in. And I'll turn you guys back on when I'm done welding it. I'm just probably gonna throw a coat of paint on here and that'll be it. All right, YouTube, as you can see, I went ahead and just painted the bar black. I also painted this bar black. Um, this one here, I have to take the anti-roll bar off, basically take the rear end out and um, everything else. And then I'll go ahead and take that all out. But as you can see here, it's coming together. Right now I have the fan on it. So blow out some of the, the smell while I'm in here. 
Yep. So in the next video, I'll be taking the rear end out, putting the the uh, frame braces for the middle of the car. I'll be welding up the frame, and then I'll get everything else welded up real good, even those upper boxes. And then I'll make another video, and I'll have all this painted black. Um, right now, I'm gonna leave the mock-up shocks on there because I don't feel like buying the, the actual shocks yet because I don't know if I'm gonna go with Strange or Menzer or QA1. It's a lot of shock companies out there, so I'll probably look into doing that. But uh, I'll get the rear end out. I'll have the whole rear end welded, painted. Um, thinking about getting another brace for the rear end, for the bottom. So that's what I might do with that. Again, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And thank you for watching my video. If you like what you see, please go down and look at my other videos. Um, I'm gonna start posting a lot more for my YouTube. Uh, I'll be just going back and forth between both garages because uh, the video that was put up either this week or last week, um, I was working on the bed panel. So I'll just be going back and forth between the two. Uh, while I wait on parts for the frame, I work in the other garage. When I wait on parts for that, I go just go back and forth. So please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Thanks for watching.